Hi, this is Nigel Collin. Thanks for joining me for this short video. And look, I guess if you're watching this, you may be still wondering, eh, will I, won't I go to the MIA conference this year? Well, let me try and help by giving you some insight into to what you can actually expect. Now, this year's conference is going to be very, very different. And there's a reason for that. You know, our industry is changing. Our market is changing. Clients' expectations, the resources we have, you know, they're all shifting. And so we need to step outside of our world in order to see things from different perspectives, get different points of view. And that's exactly what the conference is being designed to do. So for example, we've got a great range of topics and speakers, some from within the industry and some from outside of the industry. We've got industry experts, not just from Australia, but from the region and outside the region itself. And then we've also invited some end users along, clients, um, so we can hear their perspective on what's valuable to them in terms of meetings and events. Now all of that is then being supported by the structure of the conference itself. We've changed the game there. Uh, for example, we've got our thought talks. This is where each presenter gets 10 minutes to give us the heart of their key message. So it's a bit like a TED talk, I guess. And by hearing the thought talks of each of the presenters, you can then work out you know, which one you really would benefit from and follow them into a, a subsequent deep dive session, a 40 minute session, where you can get involved, unpack and explore the information to a greater extent. It really is about creating a structure that, that is more engaging and allowing you to target the information and the content that is really pertinent and relevant to you. Uh, we've also got some fantastic keynote speakers from again within and without the industry. The other thing is, uh, of course the conference is in KL, there's been a bit of talk about that and it's actually a great benefit I think to all of us and the reason that I say that is, you know, we don't work in an Australian bubble, we are part of a larger picture if you like. So to have conversations, to hear from people within the region is a huge benefit, could open up enormous opportunities. So we really do hope that by placing us all in KL that we really are going to walk away with a much broader, uh, more valuable experience and insights into our industry. And of course, uh, there's always networking. In fact, you know, you could, could argue sometimes that the networking functions are where the real opportunities crop up. I, as you probably know, am a big fan of just having a chat, a real conversation with somebody. And the more diverse we can make those conversations, who knows what opportunities are going to come forth. So have a look through the program. There's actually a lot more you can get involved with. There are special interest groups, all sorts of different things happening. You're going to be exhausted by the end of it. So look, I really hope to see you in KL. I'm really happy to be able to facilitate and MC the entire conference. I'm booked, I'm ready to go, and uh, it'd be a real shame at the end if afterwards you never came and people were talking and you'd kind of like, damn, I missed it, you know. So I hope to see you in KL.